All right, I'm back. So in a second here, we'll go ahead and start the uh, Hearts of Stone DLC and Blood and Wine. But um, I just looked it up. I'm pretty sure I got the the same ending as I did on uh, Xbox, which I didn't realize, but I got the worst ending possible. <laughs> And the weird thing is, it's not depending on uh, what choices you make, like, throughout the game. It's literally, like, the last few missions. Like, Blood, uh, where is it? Not Battle Preparations, Blood on the Battlefield is where it, uh, where it begins. And you have to make the choices there. A lot of the a lot of the choices that you make on blood on the battlefield de determines what uh ending you get so uh, the worst one possible you can get is the uh siri dies which is what i got um <laughs> and basically in order to get that you have to make three out of five negative decisions I never saw the decisions I made as negative, but apparently I made at least three of them. When I told her to relax, uh, everything's gonna be okay. On Blood on the Battlefield, she didn't like that. Um, I didn't say we need to go to the Emperor, ever. Uh, I did accompany her during the meeting with uh, the sorcerers, but I should have told her to just go herself. And, uh, yeah. Okay, now that I accidentally closed out the article, and now it won't load back again. <laughs> There's a Kotaku article in 2017. Accident got the worst Witcher 3 ending. So I literally, I mean, the other two endings that you could have gotten uh, were if if Siri survives, she either becomes a Witcher or she becomes uh, uh, the Empress. And I've got the worst one that you can get. Oh, that's, that's so weird. I opened up one thing and now the article won't even open at all. I accidentally clicked on an image and now it's like, can't be found. The heck? How does that even happen? Man. And it, and it sort of makes me want to go back. But I'm not going back that far in order to redo all that. Especially when the blood on the battlefield mission is in uh, level 20. Hold on, let me see Witcher 3 ending. Um, but yeah, I, man, I, did, I didn't even think about that. It's a bummer because we got like the worst ending for, uh, yeah, the worst ending. <laughs> it's literally titled the worst ending. Uh, battle preparations, choices, calm down. I said we have no time. And then on the blood on the battlefield, I said relax, you don't have to be good at everything. And then final preparations, I'm going with you. Uh, yeah. So, that happened. Burn. And then of course, Radavoid completely took over the entire area and killed the king and everything too. Um, the good ending, what's the, how to get the best ending? So in battle, battle preparations, you say go for it. Uh, you say, yeah, I'll go with you to Siri and blood on the battlefield. I think I might know what lifts your spirits. The emperor deny the money. 
Uh, I think we did see... I think I did do that choice. Final preparations, choices, you'll be fine on your own. I mean, I could honestly go back and do those, but that's going to take some time. Battle preparations? That was this one. I must come to fight the wild hunt. Nah, I can't. That's that's way too much. Blood on the battlefield. It's like some of these I did do, but I think it was just like my choices in the final preparations. That kind of missed. Uh, was it? No, on the blood on the battlefield, I did say relax, and then during battle preparations, I told her to calm down. If I say go for it, yeah, I'll go with you, Siri, and you'll do fine on your own during battle preparations and final preparations, then I would have been fine between these two. I would have got the best ending, but since I didn't, kind of screwed up. <laughs> I told her to calm down in the thing and I said what was the other option you'll do fine on your own or I said I'm going with you yes damn I wish I could just like select this quest and be like replay it whoa and I don't have like that many saves I have battle preparation save. I have the Isle of the Mist save slot too. The battle preparations is, was that today? 2030? Oh yeah, it was, huh? But, this it yeah this save is definitely before that this is definitely when we started today because i was still on that quest fine uh i don't think it's in wait that's they call that one the best ending where she becomes the uh empress so the good one is fun seeing you see the uh, and the heart. Ugh, part of me wants to go back and just do it. Well, let me do a manual save. Okay, I already did that one. So if we do battle preparations, let me see how far into this I am. Because I'm pretty sure we're just about right there. Whoops. Well, here's the article I was looking at. The nice thing is we could skip through like every single cutscene until getting to the end. <laughs> and if I do have one quest before uh, battle preparations, I could load that. But we'll see. Yeah, this is the one where we say everything's ready. Or, I mean, like, I could, instead of finishing the game, I could do this load and then go do these. Yeah, I think that honestly would even be better than continuing where, where we left off at. 
Um, so let me just try one more thing. Isles of the Mist, battle preparations. How far back is the Isle of the Mist? I'm pretty sure it's really far back. Or at least it's definitely, let me check main quest. All of the Mists is Act 2. So there's that, Battle of Kaer Morhen, Blood on the Battlefield, oh, Good God, that's so far back. Then there's all of these final preparations, Navi Grad, Great Escape, Payback, Through Time and Space, Battle Preparations again, Sunstone, then VD Vigo, Child of the Elder Blood, Skull Scrave, blah blah blah, Ted, the Final Age, something, something begins. Um, we'll see. Alright, I'm gonna go for it. Skip the cutscenes. Uh, we're gonna go for, just to see if we can get a different ending. We're gonna encourage her during battle preparations. Go for it. Yeah, I'll go with you, Siri. You'll do fine on your own. Okay. Alright, let's do this then. Let's uh let's try to make the good choices. Battle preparations, yeah, go for it. I really wish I said. Boring as fuck. I never doubted you would. Alright. Why did you? Might have just asked. Uh, we found the Gale Bar. All right, let's see. I'm it. Trying to get the good ending. See if it's possible. I'm not sure if it's going to be. You thank you. Even the I simply wish that's not you were about to it's simple. I shall the lot the seven. What about you waiting? Mm. Lady, good luck. Plan see it out. Wild get no, but I won't. Got no right to give her orders. Don't have the right to order her around. Amusing. I do, in fact. Tyrell recog. Tyrell. Do I have a choice? Where are you going? For a walk. Oh yes. Telling Sir. Let us pardon me. Never mind. Time is. Unless. Wait, I didn't even get to chill. Final preparations choice. You'll do fine. Isn't this? Oh wait, shoot. I think we're too far. No to follow. We have to go back even further. I think we. Yeah, because then this turns on to on thin nice. All right. Nope. It's not possible. All right. That's okay, I guess. Let's load back to this one. And I'm gonna do the uh The King of the Wild Hunt sailed aboard the Nagal Fair, a giant longship that traveled Finish game on any difficulty. As had advised, the Witcher set out to find the Sunstone. Just curious, I'm looking at these. To draw Aroden into a trap.
there any that I unlocked today? No. Guess not. All right, uh, we'll save right here. Let's just do an empty save slot. And then from this one, I'm gonna do the the DLC. So that way I'm not like running off of the bad decisions that I made from the previous. So, um, let's do that. Navigrad and Hearts of Stone is the first one. A giant longship that traveled between worlds. As Gels had advised, the Witcher set out to find the Sunstone, an artifact needed to draw Aerodin into a trap. And I can't believe we got the worst possible ending. Ugh, oh, that kills me inside. That, like, that's sad. <laughs> I can't believe that. We really did that to her. And to Geralt, man. And we had all the options to get the best one, too. But we didn't. So sad. Do this. Arts of Stone DLC. And that's the title of this, right? Arts of Stone, and that's Blood and Wine. Okay. Before we do that, Witcher. Three good ending save, maybe. Somebody made a... Huh. Console commands that change ending of game. And got the banned ending. Are there console commands to modify your save file to get the good ending? I've seen commands to change romance decisions, but I haven't seen any. Probably possible, but require strings for knowing you have to find... This should help. <laughs> you just add it in? Hold up. Add fact. Three years ago. Uh, it's okay. They said it worked. Thank you so much. The bad ending was hard on the soul. Dude, that's how I am feeling right now. Much better this go around. Going for... Now on to the DLCs. Uh, this oldish post, but I spent some time searching the commands, and this one wasn't a Google. Rules regarding decisions. Wait, what? Right. Do not like the choices you already made in the saves. You may be able to change them with the debug console mod on PC, but do this at your own risk. The following list shows all the facts that. Are relevant to 
that are relevant to ending of the game. Those highlighted in red are true in save styles, while those in gray are false. For the others, the quests that set them have not been reached yet. Use the command add fact to the true fact or remove to make it false. Try to avoid combination of facts that make no sense. A snowball fight, okay. Let's do one more. Okay, so if we add this then. Well, originally posted by C view posts and there's no axe in the game. Act two begins with ugly baby. Thank you so much for posting this. I was able to get the better ending thanks to console commands. Okay. So technically this should work. Went to Skull's Grave with Siri. We did do that. Pretend face lodge. Okay, we did do that one. Accept any reward. Let me make sure I didn't do this one. Good choice, good choice. Assist the rat avoid in this reason of state. Oh. Good. Uh, so let me just read this real quick. So, you supposed to add blah blah blah. Start of the direct quote, two saves, and blah blah, blah. one at the beginning of Ugly Baby, and another just before already completed. Do not like the choices already made in the saves. Wait, I'm confused. Start of direct quote. Two saves in eight in these saves. You may be able to change them with the debug console. All right, let me just click on this link and see what it sa says. Cause I'm wondering like, do you have to make these choices or enter in these choices before you do all this or endings of the game those highlighted in red are true in the save files while those gray and gray are false for the others wait what 
Those highlighted in red are true, while those in gray are false. Where does it have colors? I'm confused. Use command add fact to make fact true or remove fact to make it false. Try to avoid combination of the facts that make no sense. <laughs> All right, uh, let's try this. Let's 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 give it a shot. Might as well. Let's do another empty save slot. And then now, oh, we got some character entries. Okay. I think that definitely did change some stuff back there. So. Let's do battle preparations. And we're just going to run through this. Run through the, uh, the ending mission. See if we can just straight up. Complete it and get the good ending and then do the DLC. <laughs> if not, this is my only shot. Between worlds. As Gels had advised, the Witcher set out to find the Sunstone, an artifact needed to draw Aerodin into a trap. Bullpix, Machop, Rhyhorn, or Dratini. Which Pokemon do you want for February Community Day? It's gonna be Rhyhorn from everybody's previous votes it seems like so all the stuff that I just chose in the console commands it should technically give me the good ending so long as they all added in there so loud And let me just check. Uh, which are three console commands? Just to make this easier as well. Uh, to fast track it. We are going to do. Gerald C. Why did you? Yes, Gal. All right, everything's ready. Gal, well, it's see. I'm. Whew, here we go. Let's give this a shot. Let's see if she reacts differently when we're doing the battle planning instead of like being in the back like this. You will position your- Thank even those of us. I simply- That's- You are about- It's simple. I shall- The log- The seventh- Wow. He's- Not do He's do- Good luck. Plan. No. But I will- Don't have the- Amused- I do- Tyrell- Tyrell- Do I have- Where are you going? For a- Oh yeah. Telling letters, pardon. Never mind. Time is Yen. To see you. Ooh. Something happened. This is new. Not yet, but it might soon. I think. We may not have. We've come along. I admire your optimism. Listen to me. Once it's over, if we survive. Yeah, this is to definitely leave. gonna work. Go far away. And I'd like you to come with me. Where? Wherever. To Povis, beyond the Dragon Mountains, Zeracania even. As far as possible from politics, plots, and so-called high I society. added in the, uh, we romance, uh, uh, Yennefer. I'd go anywhere with you. The answer I was hoping for. 
Go, Geralt. Have a lock of And don't get killed. Awesome. Yeah, this should work then. That's funny. Heard of the dry Oh. Alright, let's go so, Avalon. Yep, we can start. Let's get with. Skipping through some of these cutscenes makes it so much faster. Why is it so loud? It got even louder this time. Too many shifts. there Doing this. I think that works, or maybe not. Oh, whatever. Where is this stupid console command? There's like a kill all one or something. I 
temperature three kill console. There was one. God, heal me like a boss. Boggle this command. When like a boss mode is enabled, all damage you deal will be 40% of the recipient's maximum health. If the NPC you damage has maximum health of then of 10,000, with this mode you will deal 4,000 each hit. God, this command will toggle God mode for your character when God mode you are in its full and not take any damage. Learn skill, cat, shave, set tattoo. Show pins. Buff me. Gives you a specific effect for a special duration. Ah, uh, you have to do that. Okay, I see. Cool. Oh, I kill. That's why. <laughs> Dude, I don't want to favor that. Whoops. Kill. Earn skill. Kill all. Yeah, it is kill all. Oh, kill all distance. Uh, kill all will kill all nearby. The distance specified. All enemies within that will be killed. Okay. So it's like kill all five. Let's try. Maybe not. What? Oh my god. Oh no, I broke him. Let's see. It's a never ending fight. Alright, what's the kill all distance? Optional in the distance relative to your character. Oh, it says it's optional. Stop rain. Make it rain. Gotta be a Witcher 3 one hit kill. One hit. Man. This is what happens when you break the game.
Oh, there we go. Maybe this will... We were probably waiting for that to happen, I guess. Yeah, that's what it was. That's one hit. There you go. That's why he wasn't taking any more damage, because he had to open the portal. Okay. I'm so glad that I found out that there's console commands that you can do this with rather than going all the way back and doing it. I don't think it's really going to make that much of a difference since uh, the DLC is technically before the official ending, but still. there. Yennefer. We must get the good ending, Yennefer. Please. She cannot die this time. <laughs> Wait, since I'm in God mode. Yes. <laughs> Can I actually just run? I'm fine. I can do this, Yennefer. Must finish this a good way. Carol, where nearby? Shut. I've heard. I think I'm. I think when I am. I do. Will you, Avalok, speak? Only 
you have seen. There's gotta be it. A... What can you know? This is my story. Good luck, Sid. No, you don't keep me waiting. Alright, let's see if it's any different this time. During this portion. Got different. Ah, here we go. Now she sees the memories. <laughs> I remember that. Okay. All right, let's see what happens this time. Zima. Yeah, pretty sure this is the one she becomes Empress. The gentleman will follow. Something ends, something begins. They let him rabble, and now decently. Tim Shaw, Evaipot. The Novigrad delegation is half a day's travel from here. They truly are Russian. Return to your post. What of Novigrad's yes, higher up? What of him? <laughs> There's some Will gear I dropped from, like, the beginning of the game. Haha. <laughs> 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 His imperial medal. Garen Vatgan, Vakelm. Enough. Did it happen? The white cold. They're familiar with the prophecy. Siri tried to stop it. She did, but paid the ultimate price. Where is she is dead? The body? I doubt it'll ever be found. Who else knows? Avalach, Elven Sage. But I doubt you'll find him either. And Yennefer? She's decided to stay in the north. Provided you don't object. I don't. And you? Plenty of work for witches after a war. I'll travel east, maybe north. Did Cyrilla say... Did she ask you to convey anything?
She regretted not getting a chance to say goodbye. Did she tell you this? Really? Didn't have to. Did you kill Siri? I she thought I saved her this time. I know that. I got the so I'm on my second ending. If there's nothing else. There is, but she was supposed to survive. Witcher. I do not wish to see you ever again. I'm so confused. Cheeky boy. <laughs> What's going on, cool? Um What? You're supposed to survive this time. That's the Or maybe this is it. I'm so confused. This is a different ending than my last one. With your wagon. Think we'll be all right. <laughs> <laughs> Aye, you betcha. We'll manage. True. The barrels are ample. Oh, I know what ending I got. Soon. Change is coming. True. No denying it. Nilfgaard flees, yet here it seemed nothing could move oh, them. I see. I see where this is going. Left their wine behind too. That's generous. Sure you don't need any help? I believe we will manage. Where you headed? So officially, in, I didn't romance like, either yeah. of them. But Supposed to meet someone first. since I got the Before horrible ending, I found some console commands that changed the out. ending. So I did that, and uh, now I'm getting. They there's two good endings technically. It really depends on which one you prefer, but I think this one is probably going to be the best ending for me. Go to the ruined fortress. I am just there. That. <laughs> Slow Never gonna forget down. that. Dude, I haven't made my own uh, beef jerky in so long. I don't think I honestly will ever probably make it again either. Unless if I really want to. I don't know. It's so hard to get like some tiny slices of meat like that. Guys gotta do what a guy's gotta do. <laughs> I love it. Alright, here it is. Master Ort. <sighs> Probably got held back. What was that? What is? You're late. Have you watched Soldier. the Netflix show? Blocking yeah. The roads, I know. That's no actually matter. pretty much yeah, what got me back agreed. into this. Just like a lot of other people. Blade. Weight just under 40 ounces. Silver plated siderite steel core. Glyphs and runes both the length of the blade and on the hilt. Beautiful. Free tip sword. Been in this trade for three decades. Only the best swordsman of the coin for my wares. When I say no witcher has. Or ever had a better weapon. You ought to trust me. Reputation precedes you, Master Ort. I'd never doubt you. The inscription, as you asked. Zirael. Swallow. Classic Elder Speech runes. No styling. Simple and precise. May I? It is yours. Mm. If you'd like to test it, had my lackeys put out a training dummy. It's a much better mm -hmm. ending than what I got. Your payment. <laughs> Gems only, as requested. I mean, start reading the books? Dude, that's awesome. I might, an eye out for I might do that um, no, the in the Forest. if I do, I do like audiobooks or something like that. First, but after, who knows? Maybe. Good luck in the path, Witcher. Go to the inn. Okay. 
Now we make another trip. Yeah, this this ending is uh a lot better. The other one, the first one I got was so sad. I can't believe that. I'm so thankful for finding these commands. <laughs> I think this is the ending I got on my first playthrough. I'm pretty sure my first, so like my first first playthrough was on Xbox, but you couldn't do any like console commands or anything and I wasn't gonna replay the entire game. So I'm on PC and I looked it up, like how to get the good ending. And I found some, if you enter the, the commands, it like changes the, some choices that you made. Did that and uh, here we are. <laughs> Is it done? Yes. Did he believe you? I have no idea. For the cockatrice. And we've a new contract. It won't pay much, but I think it worth the toil. You've been busy. It's yours. So cool. A witcher's sword. Swallow. Ooh, beautiful. May I? Not here. You'll have ample opportunity soon enough, Witcher. Let's try it out then. So much better. <laughs> oh my god. Cheater. Boy, I was not going to pl replay the entire game for that. GG. Robbed of Radovid's tactical genius, the northern realms could not withstand Emir's count. Yes. Here we go. Black banners appeared over Novigrad and all Redania. Weary of rebel raids, Emir Varemris conceded, restoring Temeria as a realm in liege to the Empire. When the guerrillas laid down their arms, the Emperor shifted his forces to other fronts. Through Nilfgaard's victory, Temerians got their country back, and history once again proved a consummate trickster. Having dealt with Radovid, Emir of Vardemris did the same with enemies domestic. The Emperor's loyal spies named all who had conspired against him, traitors, soldiers, and aristocrats alike. Though their mutiny had only been a murky plan, the Emperor showed no mercy, as was his wont. While the continent bled engulfed by war, Skellica bloomed under Ceres's enlightened rule. Unlike those who had come before her, the young queen did not raid foreign shores. Looking instead to her people. I'm glad I, I chose Cyrus. The island-bound nation prospered, though its fangs of yore were dulled. Cyrilla, Fiona, Ellen, Rhiannon, heir to Nilfgaard's throne, chose the life of a witcher on the path. Geralt taught her all he knew, every skill he possessed, then each set off on their own. Soon word of the ashen-haired witcheress had spread throughout the north, from the Yoruga the mountains of Kovir. While monarchs moved borders and populations, Geralt and Yennefer lived a calm, quiet life, far from all things political. <laughs> they breakfasted well after noon, more often than not in bed, and passed the days on lazy strolls and long conversations. Boring, you say? Perhaps. But both had sought this more than anything else. So Zian on my playthrough too, yeah. Especially after, I think like my very, very first playthrough. Um, I tried romance in the, cause back then, like I didn't care at all. So, and I didn't really follow the lore, but I tried romancing both of them. 
and then they did that like one trickster thing where they like change you to the bed <laughs> and stuff so I uh, after that I was like okay interesting um but yeah all right let's save over this one so I don't, I don't want to ever play that save again <laughs> So yeah, um, after realizing that like Yennefer is technically like uh, Geralt's one true actual love, that's when I was like, all right, yeah, I'm not gonna even bother with uh, Triss really. I didn't even do her side quest and she still showed up at the day of the battle at the fortress and helped out. So I was like, okay, cool. Sucker. Such a B word though. <laughs> yeah, I got uh I got goofed. They done tricked me the first time around. But not this time. No no. Are you kidding me? I think he just died. What? Okay. He couldn't get up for like three seconds there. That's weird. Do we still have? Wait, hold up. Do we still have the side quest? Oh, we do. That's kind of cool. Now I can't get through this. Bridge, you're in the way. <laughs> go, go. Alright. Um, I'll start the... The Hearts of Stone uh, DLC now, officially. But first, before we do that... Travel... Here. Oh, I think I clicked on the correct one. Um, I'm gonna run to the bathroom real quick, too. 